Hey guys, I was out here um, checking on a few things and I noticed some of our silky, uh, sweet, white turnips are coming up. Let's see if I can get under here and show y'all. You see that? Look at there. Got some over there. Got one or two in there. So they are doing well over in this um, new little area. Y'all know last time we had them inside the cage over there where the where the red um, where the uh, red cabbages are, but we moved them over here, and they seem to be doing well. So we'll keep an eye on them. We picked some more uh, garlic leaves. We're gonna break these down and get them ready for um, dehydrating. Also, with the rain we've been having, the collars are starting to really jump now. We got a few collards that came back from last year. You see, they went to flowering. That one down there is an older one. This is an older one. That one and that one is an older one. Our carrots doing well uh, let me show you all the uh, pop choy or bok choy is what it's called in the u.s i believe that's the only difference i've seen our spinach still got some spinach coming out we got some new spinach little leaves starting to show y'all know we did pop choy in this whole area but we've only had a few come up but i see some baby flowers as well there's one of our pop choys. It looks like it's doing well. We got a broccoli or a cauliflower over there. A couple over there. We got more collard greens down here. So, everything seems to be doing good. I don't see any tomatoes coming up yet. Well, I take that back. Over in our green bin, we planted some more uh, tomatoes. So, I do see some tomatoes coming up in there. So, other than that, um, the potatoes y'all know we filled up this bin and it rained today so everything is looking good everything's looking really good garlic onion our strawberries are starting to overflow in here the leaves anyway so hopefully strong leaves mean a lot of berries we've been seeing a lot of flowers in here so we'll see and our blueberries Our blueberries have turned to bells, and I'll check tomorrow when it's lighter out. It's uh, late evening now, so you guys can't see those bells. But hopefully they pollinate it, and we'll get plenty of uh, blueberries off this bush. This other bush is looking good, but it did not get any flowers on it this year. So it's still, I believe, I believe it's still recovering from last year, but it's doing the best it can, so... <laughs> So, we'll just keep an eye out. Our raspberry um, vine here, they are getting a lot of leaves on the vines. These are the old vines from last year. So, hopefully, we'll have um, some raspberries this year. Alright, so it's late. I'm sniffling. <laughs> so, it's definitely time to uh, go in. We were also doing a bit of de-weeding. Don't forget, guys. <sighs> de-weeding is the name of the game. If you don't want your vegetables to strangle from the weeds, you got to get out here and uh, de-weed. This year, y'all know I told you, I chose not to use preen or uh, any kind of uh, de-weeding chemical. And I'm just doing it myself. So, all right. Thanks for watching. Bells dance in the gold.